Hey everybody, it is Ed. I just recently made a video where I had shown a couple of albums that I had recently obtained and uh, including Elvis's 24 Carat Hits and a record club pressing from, I believe, 1976 of Elvis Aloha from Hawaii with the tan labels. And there was something else that I had acquired that for some reason, I forgot to pull out and show. And then I remembered, I was like, oh, that's right. I had this too. So I figured, all right, well, gives me a reason to make a video because I haven't really been making any recently. But also, I didn't realize that we had a special significance regarding this album that just passed this March 20th of 2024. Because on March 20th of 1974, 50 years ago, this album was released. Why am I showing you the back cover? Well, there's a reason. All right, and the album is Elvis Good Times, with a stellar selection of songs that were recorded in 1973 at Stax Studios and became known as the Stax Sessions. Now, Okay, so what do you mean you just picked this up? Isn't this something that you had? Yeah, it, it is something that I had. However, there's something on here that I did not have, which was this cutout. No, I'm kidding. Turn it around and you can see that there is the second hype sticker that this album received. First one was just a pink, um, I don't know if it was, I think it was a circle, pink circle with a white in it as well. It said, My Boy. The single was My Boy. And um, it meant Square also. I'm not, can't remember now, regardless. But this one has the songs, I've Got a Thing About You, Baby, and Take Good Care of Her. And it says that it contains the smash hits. There you go. So, uh, as you can see, the sticker price at the time of this cutout it was two ninety nine back in probably nineteen seventy four seventy five, and it has the hype sticker on it. Now, how's the vinyl? Vinyl's in nice shape. Uh, definitely could use a cleaning, but overall looks pretty good. It is, of course, on the orange vinyl Dynaflex. I guess I may as well just take it out and show you. But again, we are talking that this album has already been released over fifty years ago. There you go. Look at that. So these are the Stereo 8, ta uh, Stereo 8 Tape Catalog listing. And the... Oh, these are uh, Stereo 8s as well. I thought one side was the 8-track and the other side was the cassettes. All right, but it is the orange label. And it is a 2S, 2S pressing. And like I said, just could use a cleaning. And I have not thrown it on the turntable to see how it actually sounds. But, like I said, looked pretty good. And I gotta tell you, the price was right because I paid less than. Are you ready? Are you ready? Uh, put it this way I paid a dollar more than, than what this had. So, just $3.99. I couldn't pass it up. So, there you go. I figured for four bucks. That was definitely worth it for the hype sticker. And, um, yeah, so that that's it. It's a very short one today, but I thought I would show that as well as I forgot that that was part of the, uh, the fines. So there you have it. But if you would like, you can leave me a comment. And do appreciate you watching. Good to yourselves, good to each other. Have a great day.